Hi guys, how's it going? Look at it, it's beautiful. A bit windy, but can't beat the old sunshine. So, first things first, I'm gonna basically this is just a ramble. Um, I've got it, I've searched high and low and found this in a homebrew home brew shop. Uh, I'll come to that in a minute, but yeah, everybody's been going on about this. I wanted to um, buy this for ages of search high and low and I've got the hard book, hard back book, six quid, six pound. Awesome. Right, I made a list of all the things to talk about. And look the first take, the, um, the list went flying. So, um, right, anyway, so I've got this at my local homebrew shop, which is getbrewing.uk. Um, it's a sort of, um, it's a s sort of smallish homebrew shop run by Alan Thompson and his wife Jill. Uh, it's, it's awesome, it's got everything that you need. It's got yeast, it's got uh, brew pots, it's even got the grain father in it. Um, he brews his own beer. And you, you turn up there and they offer you a drink. And it's, it's just awesome. Uh, you know, you can have a nice conversation about what he brewed last and what I brewed last and stuff. But what I do is um, I'll put the address underneath somewhere. Um, I did talk about it in my last video, but um, I really forgot to put the address and stuff. But um, yeah, go there, guys. It's in South Sea. Um, it's brilliant. But anyway, right, next one on the list. <laughs> I'm gonna have a drink. Siren Crab Brew, Liquid Mistress. I've had this before. Only once. And it was this, the same night I had the Rising Tides, so I'm going to crack this open. Oh, la bebe. Yes. All right, let's give this a pour. Look at that. I'll stop it there. I don't know if there's any sediment in there, but if not, I don't think there is, but I'll drink half in a minute. Oh. That. Beautiful. I'll, I'll see if I can catch the old. Hold on. I don't know whether you can see that. That's gorgeous. It is. This is a red IPA. Uh, Five point eight percent. Beautiful. Look at that. It's just glorious. It's like black currant colour. Beautiful. Beat a drink like that. Damn. Beautiful. I've had a stressful week. Oh, man. Too much to do at work. But I'm relaxing now. I've only got a half day tomorrow, so I thought, that's on it. I'll have a little drink tonight. Right. And the last thing I want to talk about is. Right, I've done four or five um, brewing bag, no chill brews. Um, basically I mash with 20 litres of water and I end up with 11 litres going into my no chill cube 
and every single brew, and I mean every single brew, spot on 1046. What's that about? Um, my last brew was supposed to be 1056 or 1058. Nope, 1046. Um, I don't sparge. Um, I mean, I'm not too bothered. I mean, 1046. It's gonna, it's gonna give me a, like a four, four point five percent something beer or whatever. Um, so I'm not too bothered about it. But sparging, that means I've got to um, think of a new way of um, heating up some more water. But then, if I do do that, then I, I'm gonna have more than basically. I'm gonna have more than my eleven liters going into my no chill cube unless I mash with less water but I don't know that's something for me to think about um, anyway this is lovely I've got my smash beer ferments in the way beautiful I think maybe this weekend or the weekend after I think I might do another brew uh, zombie dust and I think I'm gonna use uh, not an enemy strain um, for the yeast on the zombie dust because I've used the USO5 and I've used the USO4 um, I really wanted to use the USO5 on this one, but like I said in my last video, I forgot to bloody <laughs> buy it at the homebrew shop when I was there, like a muppet. But I've got some, um, I've got some Nottingham yeast laying about that needs using up, so I thought, sod it, why not? Got to experiment. Mm. This is beautiful. Truly an exquisite drink. On this exquisite afternoon. Look at it. Um, clouds over there, but that way, which you can't see, blue sky. Perfect. But anyway, that's enough. That's a bit of a ramble. So anyway, um, I'm going to leave you to it. And I'll see you in the next video, guys. Take it easy.